JSS Academy of Higher Education and Research School of Life Sciences Uti Campus Hill in the Desia Arivial Dinam Kondada Patadu. Desia Arivial Dinam Ayurati Tolagarati and Bathi Edam and Mudal February Yuruba the Yetam Tedi Nadamudavatam Kondada Patavari. Either in Munite in the School of Life Sciences Uti Campus Hill, Nilagari Pali Mana of Mana Vigalaka, Arivial Pachipoti Nadata Patadu. Either Patu Paligal in the Palve Mana of Mana Vigal Pangatiner in the Nigal Chikas Serapa Vidanaka. Cosmic Ray Laboratory, Anda Kadir Aivakam, Tata Institute of Cantonmental Research, Tata Adipadai Arach Nirvanam, Udakayil Yirende, Munever Atul Jain Avakal Kalanda Kondar. In the Nigal Chiki Munever Chandra Shaker, Talever, School of Life Sciences Uti Campus, Talimi Vagitar. In the Portugal Veggie Petramana Vamana Vigalaka Parisical Vadanga Patadu. In the Nigal Chi Todande, SLS Kaluri, Palver Three Manavagal, Palimana Vagalaka Parisodani, Sayal Vilakatani Say the Kanbi Tanner, Mail Moringini Palakal Kalanda Konda Serapo Vendanakum, Talevakum, Palimana Vagalakum, either Nuku with the Asri Gulakum, Nandri Terivitaner. Technology is my topic for today. Integrated science and technology has created a sustainable future. Combine together to form humans. I think all are aware of this generation with the help of technology. Science and technology combine together in various aspects of agriculture. occasion that uh, today the JSS uh, School of Life Sciences has organized uh, allocation uh, for the National Science Day and the theme is very apt for uh, today's scenario that uh, integration of science and technology for a sustainable future. So it brings us to a very uh, important concept of uh, how do we use the science and technology so that by using the science and technology, we can still have a sustainable future. So now here the sustainable future can be defined in multiple ways. Like uh, we can define that sustainable future we can have by preventing our nature. So for that two forces are responsible. One the force which are creating the science and technology like with uh, rapid industrialization or modernization or urbanization. We are over utilizing the resources of the nature. So that should be minimized or reduced. Or that should be conserved as much as possible. But then there is another second uh, very, very important aspect that how do we consume the resources? Like how do we consume the technology or how do we consume the natural resources? So for there, like there is a word in Sanskrit and Hindi that is called Sanyam. Sanyam means how we can uh, use the resources for bare minimum requirement. Let us say I want to have a watch. So yes, watch is a necessity for me. but one need not have 100 watches or 20 watches or I need not change the watches for that one. So that itself will reduce the production or use of the unnatural resources in the terms of that. And same thing applies for the food as we know that today world is facing the scarcity of the food. So how can we manage the scarcity of the food? There are two ways to do that. One way is either we develop science and technology and bring a modern technique by which in the same amount of the land we can produce two times or five times more the crop output. That is one way to do it. 
But at the same time, all of us we know that in the world, in each home, we are wasting so much food which is being produced today. Let's say if that ratio, uh, I'm not very sure, but if that is in the range of 20% or 30% wastage of the food on the earth, if we can simply manage not to waste that food, then straightforward without doing anything, we have 30% extra food to feed the people who are going hungry. So I think, and the effort taken by the JSS is very good because it's the young generation who should realize about all these aspects and take this into account so that we can, all of us have a sustainable future, a sustainable future in a good environment. And all of us are lucky that we stay in Nilgiri, so we don't see many problems. But once you go down to any of the big cities, we can see around there are so many issues related to the environment and the health of the uh, thing. So I think that's a good initiative uh, taken by the institution. And uh, I hope that all of us together can, uh, with the help of science and technology, we can have a sustainable future. Thank you very much. Oh, JSS Academy of Higher Education Research Lab. We are now uh, in February 28th. National uh, Science Day celebrate Panro. That is the 26th. Uh, Naraya schools have elocution competition conduct Paniko. In Niki, 18 schools want to participate Panir Kanga. In the year, the theme is uh, sustainable development. That is the same thing. We have many sources in the future generation. We have many resources in the future generation. We have many resources in the future generation. We have the future generation. We have many resources in the future generation. We have many resources in Namlakaga, sell the Vitit Poirkanga. Nama Ada, Ipo enjoy Panitruko. Ipo Nama Yirkar, the Elatin, Namale, Elatio, Titatomna, Nama generation to Apro, Yenago Adakaga and the initiative Edgar Gardada in the in the Vashadot team. Nama Vande, Elatuko, Naraya Vande, Padgakano, Nama nature, food, Elatin Padgakano, obtaining Rada in the Vashadot team. That's why we celebrate in the School of Life Sciences, Uti Campus. Thank you.